welcome to my channel this is Mimi and you are watching budget with me um, in my videos I do do weekly cash stuffings as well as budgeting videos I am going to try to start doing some other types of videos I do do like condensing videos and things of that nature um, but this video is my weekly cash stuffing video I just posted my monthly budget video um, Monday morning and now here it is we are doing my cash stuffing here on Tuesday morning so here is my cash breakdown um slip that I created these are going to be available in my Etsy shop once I get everything up and running you can you can either print these out and use them as pieces of paper or you can laminate them and you know reuse them I just wipe this down let it dry and then I use it again so I'm just going to set that inside of my cash tray and then here's all of the cash. So we'll be cash stuffing $1,375 today. Um, and this is all of the cash. Actually, let me take this off. And I am going to go ahead and count it for you guys because I know some of you were upset when I don't count things. So I will count it. So we have one, two, three hundred, twenty. I said 20. See why I don't count? <laughs> 300, 350, 450. I'm going to use my calculator just in case. 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 83. 20, 40, 60, 84. 20, 40, 60, 85. 20, 40, 60, 80. So 580. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, so 190, and then 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 6, 7, 8, 9, 100, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, and 45. Did I mess up? messed up so we've got to count again <laughs> because I messed up I have 1365 and it should be 1375 so somewhere I messed up either with the fives or the tens somewhere so we have 1 2 300 350 400 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1,000, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 92, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 55, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 3, 5, 10, 15, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So now it's correct. So that is $1,375 that we will be cash stuffing today. Let me just go ahead and separate all of this out. All right, all of the cash is separated. So as always, we get started in my wallet and we're gonna just pull everything out from right here so everything is in the front. And we're also 
going to unstuff my coins. So this wallet actually came with a backpack purse that my mother-in-law purchased for me. Um, and she didn't even know that it had a wallet inside the bag. But when I opened it up and I was taking like all the stuffing out, this was down at the bottom. And my envelopes fit perfect in here. So I'm going to be alternating this one because I absolutely love it. It is so pretty. And then I do have my receipt here that I have to scan into such rewards. Um, if you guys don't know what it is, it is a way to receive money back for the purchases that you have made throughout the week. Right now, they are doing like a daily bonus. So I don't have a lot of receipts because I have been scanning one receipt every single day to get the bonus points while they're still doing them. So yeah, why not get bonus points when I can? So we're going to start by unstuffing my cash envelopes that are in my wallet. So starting with gas, we have $63 left. Food, I didn't really spend any money on food. I've been around my house the last few days. Um, and I didn't work every day. So I actually haven't spent a lot at all on food. So I have 20, 40, 50, 1, 2, and 3. Um, I spent seven dollars <laughs> and I think I might have just bought snacks um giving is empty and my tips that were in cash are six dollars I actually have more cash tips than this but I gave someone ten dollars for lunch um because they helped me out with uh putting the groceries inside of my car so I gave them ten dollars to buy some lunch for themselves so this is what we have for the week we're going to go ahead and set this off to the side because this is actually going to go into my rollover envelope and we're going to count that up at the end and i'm going to decide if i'm going to do that video um this week or if i'm just going to wait until the end of the month and do one big one what am i doing <laughs> there we go so i'm gonna just set this off to the side of my desk and i'm also going to just put my coins away because my coin jug is actually heavy and yeah it's heavy i don't want to pick it up <laughs> um so we're gonna just start with my um, envelopes that go in my wallet because they're right here so as always gas gets a hundred and Fifty dollars, so 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, and 50. I'm gonna just count it again. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 50 goes into gas. Food gets sixty dollars, and I have been trying not to spend this money at all throughout the weeks. That is just like a little self challenge that I'm doing. Um, you know, just I'm close to home and it makes no sense to buy food when I have food at the house. Giving is going to get $5. So one, two, three, four, and five. And this blank one is for any cash tips that I get throughout the week or if I do carry cash with me I'll just put it in this one um, but normally I do not carry cash other than the ones that go in my wallet so we're gonna start this stuffing off with my bills binder so starting with Apple Apple is getting $28 today so that's 20, 25, 26, 27, 28. And in here now, we have 20, 40, 45, 50, 51, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. 56. So I have a bonus um check that I'm going to get at the very last Tuesday of this month. And I'm trying to decide if I should 
stuff it um stuff my bills or if i should just stuff my savings challenges with that money and some of my sinking funds you guys give me like some suggestions that you guys suggest it'll put me at least a week ahead with my cash stuffing on my bills binder if i do do it that way i'll be one week ahead every single month um but i don't know let me know should i put it towards my bill binder or should i just put it towards saving challenges and my sinking funds so this is oops sorry this is my car payment we're stuffing 117 in here and good thing i did count because that was extra 10 because i was supposed to pick up a five so we have 110 15 16 17 So now in car payment, we have 100, 200, 10, 20, 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, and 4, 134. Cell phone is getting $22. So it has 20, 40, 41, 42, 43, and 44. My light bill is going to get $38, and I'm really hoping that I am budgeting enough for this because it is getting cooler at night, um, so we have been running the heater a little bit, so we'll see. If not, I'll have to just pull from sinking funds to cover the rest. Um, so we have 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, and 38. Put this with this. So now we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, 76. Health insurance is going to get $30. And I'm budgeting about $150 for this a month, but I may increase this. So we have 50, 70, 90, 100, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, and 28. My car insurance is going to get $64. So 10, 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, and 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So 128. Internet, I did have to increase this by a dollar because it did go up slightly. So we are putting eight dollars in here. Six, seven, and eight. So now this one has 50. I said 50. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. That's 15 dollars. Navy Federal is getting 25. So now there's 20, 40, 45, and 50. And y'all, when I do my unstuffing at the end of the month, I know I said that I wasn't going to spend a lot this month. I was going to cut down on spending, but that didn't happen. That did not happen. <laughs> y'all see what I'm talking about when I do it because... I, I, it didn't happen just know that <laughs> so rent is getting 132 dollars so 120 31 and 2 i really did try but my twins are making six months on the 10th and we decided at the very last minute to do like a little six month photo shoot for them so we ordered a cake we ordered their outfits some decorations and yeah so <laughs> that happened that happened so we have 100 200 20 40 50 60 61 2 3 and 4 so 264 rooms to go is getting 19 dollars so 10 15 16 17 18 and 19 
So it has 10, 20, 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. 38. Subscriptions is going to get $27. 25, 6, and 7. So it now has 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 135, 140, 41, 2, 3, and 4. $144. And then water is getting $18. So that's a 10, 5, and 3 ones. So it has 10, 20, 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. So $36. And that is it for my bills binder. And this thing is already getting full. And we still have two weeks left of bill stuffing. And I'm deciding if we're going to do three weeks of bill stuffing. Um, moving on into my family binder. So my family birthdays is going to get $5. And I did use some of this to purchase the twins um, outfits and stuff like that. I didn't want to take it from clothing, so I took it out of here. So that'll be part of my unstuffing. So birthdays has 100, 200, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, and 38. Date night is getting $15. Um, if you guys watched my budgeting video, we are going to the movies. So um, I want to like buy the snacks, if he'll let me. <laughs> I want to buy the snacks for the movies. I may not spend any of this. We'll see. But in here, we have 10, 15, 20, 25. Family Fun is getting $10. And I was trying to take the twins to the aquarium on Wednesday. However, I forgot because I am such a horrible friend. I'm really not, but I am just have been so messed up with my days. Like, I just wake up and know that it's, like, Wednesday or it's Tuesday. Like, I don't actually know the date. Like, I don't know if it's the 9th, the 10th, the 11th. I don't know those things. I just know what day of the week it is. So, my best friend's birthday is actually on Wednesday, and she is going out with her guy. Um, so, we will not be going this Wednesday. However, we won't be going next Wednesday either because the aquarium is closed on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. And Wednesdays is her off day. So, I don't know what we're going to do. <laughs> we're going to figure it out. We'll figure it out. So, we have 50, 60, 70, 80, 85. I do want to go with her because she's been asking me to go with her um, for the longest. Uh, that's something that her and her baby did um, when he was first born. And she just, I guess she wants me to experience it as well. I don't really go to the aquarium. I find it kind of boring, but she likes it. So we're going. That's where we're going. Um, the twins are getting 40. So the twins have $2,003 in the bank. So what I decided to do is I actually purchased these other prop bills to represent the interest that I'm accumulating because I kind of want to have that in the envelope as well so I know how much I actually have. So we have 2000 20 40 60 80 82 83 So we have $2,083. Um, $2,003 is actually in their savings account that is for them. Um, and guys, I, this money is not strictly for their savings. It, I do spend some of this money on them. I haven't been spending it on them because their money has been coming out of other funds. Obviously, like clothing and things like that. Christmas is just going to come out of those funds versus their own funds. But when those things are over and I buy them like books or something like that, it's going to come from their fund and then the extra goes into their savings account. Because I do still want to build that. Um, uh, miscellaneous. Is this one getting anything? Oh, yeah. This one's getting $5. So, we have 10, 15, 20, 25. 
And this one is just for in the event that I go over on one of my other ones, I have this here. Um, Marco is also getting $5. So he has 120, 25, 30, 31, and 32. And as I speak, he is walking into my room. <laughs> such a baby next up is my personal binder uh, first up we have beauty which is getting five dollars so I have 50 60 65 70 71 hair is getting ten dollars so it just has 20. Personal is getting 40. And I have spent quite a lot on this out of this. So most of this will be gone when we do our unstuffing. So we have 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 329. Some of it I spent in cash, so some of it is not here. Um, my savings is getting $71. 71. 50. 70. So we have 1,000, 1,500, 15, 50, 1,600, 20, 40, 45, 47, and 48. So 16, 48. And in the bank, we have $15,002. That's what this one is here. That was the interest that it has accumulated. Next up is shopping, which is also getting $10. So it has $20. And the other one is a blank one, and it doesn't have anything in it just yet. Next up is my other sinking funds. So this birthdays is getting five dollars. So it has 20, 40, 45, and 50. And I had someone comment about um why do I keep like the nicer bills uh in my videos. Guys, I didn't even know my video was kind of this dark. Hold up. It might not look dark to you guys, but it looks dark to me. So I turned on my other light as well. Um, even though I'm filming this in the daytime, my window is actually behind me. So it's not bringing in that much light, which is why I use my ring light to bring in more light. But I turned on my lamp that's by my desk because it, it just looked gloomy. It looked real gloomy. Um, but I don't know if you guys can tell the difference in like these two fives. So like this five is like brownish. And then this one looks like a newly printed five. So I just like the way these look to me. It's just personal preference. It's not a necessity. But I do like the nicer ones. And I don't like the ones that are just like bent up and all that. Like, I don't like those. Let's put that back in there. And I'm trying to like address as many, um, comments in my videos as I can there are some that I probably have forgotten but <laughs> I'm sorry if I forgot it let me know and I'll talk about it in the next one um car maintenance is getting ten dollars so we have 100 200 250 270 280 I keep hitting my thing here Maybe I should turn it, but then this cast is this shadow on it. Mm, let's put it right there. Um, clothing is getting ten dollars. So we have 50, 70, 90, 100, 5, 6, and 7, 107. Health is getting forty dollars. Some of these two twenties. So now health has fifty. 
And every time I reach this to $100, I am going to take that money out and put it towards a medical bill that I have. Um, uh, holidays is getting 20 So we have 50 70 90 100 1, 2, and 3. 103 And I will be spending some of this money when we get closer to Thanksgiving because I have to buy, like, plates and things like that for Thanksgiving dinner because I'm hosting it at my house. Um, household is getting $10, so it now has 120 40 50 55 and 56 So 156 in household. Um, this one is getting 5 So it has. So it has 15. And we are done with this one. Moving on to my business binder. Equipment is getting $30. Guys, I really want to purchase an inkjet printer. Not an inkjet printer, a laser printer. I have an inkjet printer already. I really want to purchase a laser one. Um, and then I also want to purchase another Cricut but we'll see. There's a Cricut Joy that it looks like it like prints onto the paper so that I don't have to do everything with vinyl. Um, because me and vinyl have like a love-hate relationship right now. So I was considering getting a laser printer to start printing on envelopes. Or I was considering getting the Cricut Joy, I think it is. I it based on the video that I saw, it looks like it prints onto something. So if you guys use either one of those, can you let me know down in the comments? um how it does with printing on like cardstock and things like that please and thank you <laughs> uh so equipment what's the matter hold on i think someone knocked at my door yep someone did knock at the door it was amazon <laughs> so um equipment is getting 30 dollars So we have 20, 40, 50, 55. I'm surprised he heard that because I did not hear them knock at all. And I have my room door open because the twins are in their room sleeping. So I have the door open to hear them, but I didn't hear anyone knock on the door. Uh, giveaways is getting 13. One, two, and three. So giveaways now has 50. 60, 65, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, 76 dollars. My next giveaway, I'm gonna do it at 500 subscribers. Um, or maybe I'll do 300, either 300 or 500. I'll decide. Shipping is getting 20 dollars, so it has 50. Supplies is not getting anything. I've already stuffed what I was going to stuff out of my weekly paychecks into here. And I will let you guys know I have overspent on supplies. So we're going to have to take some money from somewhere else. And then taxes is the last one. Taxes is getting $141. So it's $120, $40, and one. Why do I have a 50? Why do I have a 50? Oh, <laughs> I'm tripping. I am tripping, don't mind me. I forgot about my 100 envelope challenge. <laughs> so I was like, why do I have a $50 bill left? So in taxes, we have 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 650, 670, 690, 700, 5, 6, and 7. We have 1,770 in taxes. I really hope that I don't have to spend this money because if so, I'm going to pull majority of this out of that account and we are going to allocate it elsewhere. All right. That is the end of this one. Moving on to my saving challenges. 
So first up is my 100 envelope challenge. And in this challenge, last week we pulled the number 67. So we'll be putting in $67. So that's a 50. I like this 10 better. I don't know guys, I'm sorry. I like this five better. <laughs> Because these I'm not going to spin right now. So I, I want nicer ones. Alright. So we have 50, 60, 65, 66, and 67 going into here. And we only have $46 left from what I have budgeted for the month to go into these challenges. So hopefully we don't pull anything over 46 But so let's see. We're going to go in the front this time. 78. So we'll have to put that one back. Stay back. <laughs> um, let's go in this front. No. No. Make sure let's turn it around because I'm able to see the numbers. <laughs> 81. Why am I pulling all the high numbers? 62. Guys, 83. <laughs> I'm pulling every single high number. Like, I should have pulled this in the beginning. 57. Nope. 54. Nope. Let's pull this one. 14. Ha! Ah. Knew I would get one. Um, 46 minus 14. We can pull... 32. I think I'm just going to find 32 or find numbers that equal up to 32. It's going to, I don't know. That's 35. Part of me wants to just rearrange this. Oh, look, 31. And we won't do the dollar. The dollar will get put into rollover. Um, I'll remember to do put the dollar into rollover. So I'm gonna pull the whole 46, but this is actually 31 and 14. But I'm gonna pull out 46 dollars and I'm gonna put the dollar into my rollover. Or maybe I won't. Maybe I'll leave the dollar into my account. I don't know. I'll see. But next week we are stuffing 14 and 31, and then we will not be stuffing this one with our weekly paychecks anymore. Because I have now the 150 that I would have been putting towards that next up is not Christmas because Christmas is already fully funded at two thousand dollars um so we're not gonna do that one but we are however going to do emergency and I'm gonna be putting in fifteen dollars into emergency And let's see if I have enough to color in another piggy bank. So in emergency, we have 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 470, 480, 490, 495, 500, and $2. So yes, I do have enough to color in another one. So I'm going to grab, I think I used this color. I think. I think it's this one. I'm gonna grab this color here and we're gonna go ahead and color this now because I forget to color things if I wait. Oops. And guys, I don't think that was the right color. I don't know and I, I don't have time to figure it out but it doesn't look like it's the right color on camera it looks fine but to me it looks like it's the wrong one but we're leaving it so we have $1,502 in our emergency fund Um, and I actually don't need this. Vacation is not getting anything. That's my vacation fund. 
debt is not getting anything but what we are putting money into is this scratch off challenge so if you guys watched my budgeting video um i did say that i was going to be starting this challenge this month so i budgeted for 30 dollars because all of these numbers on all of my year my yearly scratch off one is the numbers one through 30. so i have budgeted 30 dollars for here so i will not go over 30 dollars, but i will get as close as possible to 30. let's start at this one <laughs> Let's go here. Um, let's do this one in this corner. $37. I only budgeted $30 for it. So we're going to take $7 from rollover because I have it. So we're going to take $7 from there to fully stuff what I have scratched. Maybe, maybe I won't press my luck. I mean, I was only at $10. So yeah. We'll see. <laughs> so we have. 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. So we put $37, and I just said I was not going to go over 30, and then what do I do? Go over 30. But good thing I have the rollover fund. So that is the beginning of my scratch off challenge that I am doing. And I'm super excited about this. Like, I'm so excited about doing this one. And, oh, it's actually in this one. This is my rollover envelope. So we're going to be adding all of this into here. And we're going to give this a quick count and see how much we have so far. So we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, 93, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 31, 32, 33, and 34. What did I say this was? 334? 334 sounds about right. Still, what do you guys think I should do? Should I allocate this money now or should I wait until the end of the month with the rest of my rollover? We still have um, three cash stuffings to do and then go ahead and do another stuffing video so you guys will get another bonus video this month let me know let me know what you want to see oh we're gonna put actually oh that is that is a lot that is a lot it's about to bust my envelope open let's add it let's add some of that in here it's a lot of ones so So we're taking up two slots for right now for that one all right guys and now to the fun part if you have made it to the end of this video then you're gonna know what to do in order to receive these three scratch off challenges that I have created um, these are gonna be a part of my giveaway so this is the prizes for reaching 100 subscribers and all you honestly have to do, I'm not going to make it too difficult. You have to comment in the comment section, 2023 new beginnings. No, don't say that. <laughs> 2022 new beginnings. We are not in 2023 yet, girl. What are you talking about? Um, so 2022 new beginnings. So... Put that down in the comments so i know that you did watch the video in 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 its entirety and then you will be entered in to win this 
So, if you guys made it to the end, thank you so much. And you guys, remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You guys are amazing, and I appreciate each and every one of you for your nice comments. But you guys have a beautiful rest of your day. I'm going to go spend time with my boys. Bye!